Welcome to another episode of Mondays with Milt. Now today, I'm with Brandon Green. He's one of our work leaders in the engineering department. And we're gonna talk about the new surface mounted electric stripe. Now, Brandon, if you can just kind of tell the people what is so special about the installation of this new electric stripe. Well, there's not much that's special about it. It's very simple. There's a cover here. You take this cover off, and then you have two self-capping screws. They go straight into the post. You don't have to have a pre-drilled hole to mount it to. You just attach it right on this surface of this post, then you cover it up so you don't see it, and it looks nice and pretty. So what's really good about this is the old electric stripes, we had to know if the door was gonna hinge on the left or the right, we had to know if it was swinging in or out, but not this one. Nope, this one, if you get it out here and you decide you don't like this door on this side, you can flip it around to the other one. It'll flip right around, or if you wanna change the door so it swings out the other way, you just rotate it around and then the door comes in the other way. The post doesn't have to be made special to accept different hand doors. All right, so that's very handy mm -hmm. because you can change the swing of the door in the field. What's even better about this one is I believe you can retrofit this to any door that's currently out in the field. Yep, yeah, if you already have a door and it has a hard strike, it has a mechanical lock and you wanna to add the to access control, you can add this strike in there. It'll fit in the gap of your door. The only thing you have to do to make it work with your current door is you swap out the hinges. Use a different hinge, it scoots your door over a little bit, and then you've got room for this strike. All right, so we can send you new hinges. Mm -hmm. They're a little tighter. Yep. And that works well. So you do disassemble the door, but that's pretty simple. Yes. With three holes there for the hinges. Uh, the other thing is the wiring diagram of this is a little different. So yep. for that installer, what does this one do now? So this strike, it comes available 12 or 24 volt DC field selectable. Most of the card reader systems we see run on DC current. So this one will wire straight into your, your card reader without having to do any tricks to convert the AC to DC or having to order a special strike. Before, we were only stocking a 24 AC strike. So this is more compatible with what we see people using card reader system-wise. Okay. And not only card readers, but this can work with keypads, mm -hmm. or it can work with just that little doorbell button, mm -hmm. if that's all you have. Yes. All right. Okay, well, Brandon, thank you very much for coming out here with us. That's what we got this week. We'll see you again on another Mondays with Milk.